Know that the ride or die. Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome to another video. Thanks for tuning in. So today we're gonna install and wire my new universal speedometer I got and then also fabricate some form of a bracket to have my ignition installed correctly instead of it just sitting there. Uh, so stay tuned, cheers. So real quick before we get started, I wanted to shout out Mike from Ace Cafe Bikes. He's also a cafe racer builder. He has his own YouTube channel as well, so you should go check him out. He's a super awesome dude and he's making super awesome bikes, so go check him out. Cheers. So this is the new speedometer I got. It's got just the, the classic analog input for like the speedo and then I've got um, a display for neutral, high beam, and turn signal. And what I'm gonna do is kind of what I've done for all my other wiring is just I'm gonna chop all these off and then solder this into the original like OEM connector so that it's just a plug and play. Okay, I have to do something a little weird with this last wire. It's my like high beam indicator. And on my OEM headlight connector, it's got kind of a spin-off um, bullet connector thing for that switch. So hopefully that makes sense. But this is why I ended up doing it this way, which is a little weird, but it'll work. So that's all that matters. All right, so I got this thing all soldered up and wired. Now I'm gonna make sure it's all working. So we'll test that real quick. All right, first thing we'll do is we'll plug in the connector. Gosh, that was not easy. That's what she said. And so, this was that the three prong like spin off connector I was talking about. So, this here is going to go in, into this OEM connector like that. So, we'll turn my ignition on. Okay, backlight comes on. That's great. Now we'll go left turn signal, which is just the same for both. Those both work. High beam, sweet deal. My neutral indicator isn't working for some reason. Okay, let me look into that real quick. I'll be right back. Gotta get this stupid connector through this tiny freaking hole. That's what she said. Don't 
So I got the speedometer installed. I was planning to install a little bracket for my ignition as well, but I don't actually have the sheet metal for it like I thought I did. So I'm gonna go get some of that. I'm probably gonna just order it actually because it's easier, but I'm gonna put that off for another video. But yeah, the speedometer is installed. It's working great and it looks great and I'm super stoked on it. So stay tuned for the next video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And if I can build a bike, then so can you. Cheers.